hello guys welcome to this video so in this video we will look at how to take screenshot of a specific uh, element in the web page so inside react.js so you'll be using this uh, package which is use react screenshot so you can see the demo of this application on your screen so you'll be building this so we have a button right here take screenshot so we'll be taking the screenshot here of this html section right here so as i click the button you will see it will take the screenshot and this image you will see this is actually this image which is captured and now you can save this image inside your pc as a png image and if you try to open this you will see it has taken the screenshot and save it as a png image so i will show you this is the actual module so if you go to npmjs.com it is actually a react hook which is able to take the screenshot of a specific html element it has 21000 weekly downloads so the command is very simple you just need to install this react the module name is re use react screenshot and also we will be using uh, bootstrap as well so just install these packages as well so bootstrap and react bootstrap i have already installed all these packages so i will just show you the demo so first of all you need to create a functional component and right here we will import the actual module here so we will import u screenshot it is say this hook we will be using this from u react screenshot and then we will be importing the bootstrap and then there are lots of components from react bootstrap we will use this button container row we have, we have uh, imported all the modules now we need to create some state variables so we will be creating a reference using the use ref hook of react js and then to keep track of the image so we will actually have a variable here image and take screenshot and you will be using this hook use screenshot which is coming from use react screenshot and right here in the jsx we will actually be having the container tag of bootstrap giving a class name to it margin top 5 so inside this we will have the row here and we will align it in the center position by giving the class here justify content center and inside this we will actually have a column and we will give a medium of 6 and we will align it in the center position so text center and inside this we will have a heading here which will simply say so if you just refresh now go to the so then we will be having a simple button so this button will actually say uh, take screenshot so it will be a primary button and we will be attaching a on click listener so when we click this button we will take the screenshot and we will be writing this custom function get image and we'll be giving a bootstrap class of margin bottom 3 so you need to create now define this get image function so inside this function we just need to invoke this take screenshot method and here we just need to pass the reference so what reference dot current so we have this variable so we need to give this reference to whatever html element we need to take screenshots 
so what we will do so right after this we will declare a section a div section and we will be attaching this reference to it references like id that we do in plain html and javascript reference is kind of giving an unique id to the html element in react js and then inside this div it can have any html it can have text images for now we will actually have h2 heading and a simple paragraph for just illustration purpose so if you refresh you now see a section right here we have a button if you click it now the screenshot will be taken but now to display that screenshot we also need to display the actual image variable so you can see we take the screenshot and we have this image so we now need to display this image so now to display this we can simply display it in the image tag and we will be attaching the width of the image to be 500 pixel and the source will be the image that's all that's all that we need to do so we are attaching this image so if you try to now click the button you will now see the image will be displayed and this is actually your uh, you can save image as as png image so it has taken the screenshot and save it as a png image so in this way you can use this react.js uh, library of uh, use react screenshot to take any specific screenshot of your, uh, any html element in the web page so thank you very much for watching this video and do check out my website as well freemediatools.com which contains thousands of free tools regarding audio video and image and i will be seeing you in the next video